Hello, Anne. Good evening. Good evening. Yeah, so can you hear me well, Anne? I can hear you well. Can you see me? No. No? So wait me a minute. How about now? Can you see me? Okay, I see you. Okay, very good. So that's good to know. So anyway, how's the weather in your place right now, Anne? What uh, my country is um, is cool. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it's cold. Yeah, same here in the Philippines. It's so cold. It's been three days that it's very cold here. Okay. So by the way, thank you for doing your homework. And I wasn't able to check that one. And yesterday, sorry, because I attend. I I went. To have some pers it was a personal errand yesterday that's why i wasn't able to attend our class yeah so here it is let me why 
why is it that you cannot see my screen? Can you see my screen now, Ann? Yeah. Uh, yes. yes. Okay, so please open your camera, Ann. Wait me. Oh no. Yeah, so look at my screen. Tell me if we're done with this one or not. Yeah, but it's so lag. That's why I can't control it. So maybe I'll just have it all here. Exit. Okay, are we done with this one, Anne? Done. Yes, this is okay. done. Done. Okay, done. Done. Read the task below. Plan your essay. Be following the instruction. Okay, so that's done. Okay, ah, are we done with this one? Wait me a minute. So here, let me start with this one. So can you see my screen clearly, Anne? Okay. Okay, are we done with this? Okay. Yes. How about this one? Done. Okay, how about this one, Anne? It's done, Lisa. Okay. Um, how about this? No. Not yet. Okay, so here in task three, can I want you to match the paragraph of the letter one to four with the four of the headings below to A to F. So take, take your time and...
Okay, so we have here one, very good, two, three, four. Okay, so that's great. And so you got a perfect score of four out of four. So now let's proceed with this one. I want you to choose the correct conjunction to complete the sentence. So you can use a dictionary to help you if needed. Okay, so if there were no cars, lorries, van in the world, you couldn't travel long distances. So you circle your answer, please. Okay, so we have here, you couldn't travel long distances unless you went by public transport. You would probably shop locally rather than going to a big supermarket. The motorways would be empty so you could cycle on them safely. Then last number, we would eat more food from our local area since it would be difficult to transport it from other places. So only one mistake, that's still good. Three out of four. So let's proceed with this one, Anne. I want you to read the useful phrases for summing up. Then find one more in the letter. Which paragraph does it begin? Okay. Do you know what to do here, Anne? Okay, so great.
Okay, so are you done? Are you done, Anne? Okay. Not yet? Okay, I'm done. Okay, so we have here all in all. Yes, very good. So now, here, I want you to read this letter. Yeah, dear sir or madam. So here, do you agree or disagree with the writer's opinion? I want you to give reason, Anne. So can you please read this letter first, loudly? Yes, so madam, I'm ready to express my disappointment at the consulate's decision not to include any circulate in town. Since I do not you know, I don't, don't have a car. I see for everyone, so this is a very important issue for me. My main reason is objecting that discussion, discussion is that social lens improve the safety of cyclists. We are successful in most cyclists are injured in accidents as is. And it's far more difficult for drivers to see them. I realize, uh, I realize that this is an expensive to build cycle lane. However, it is a good use of public money. Pollution is a problem. Okay, so do you agree or disagree with the writer's opinion? Why or why not? I didn't, um, I agree with um, the writer of Neil because because the um, bicycle is um, because a bicycle should have a uh, Yes, they should have a cycle lanes. What else? Uh, 
so what reduce um Absolute and uh, absolute is drop. Yes, that is correct. I dis I agree with the writer's opinion also. It is so good to have a cycle lane. Do you write a uh, a uh, Bicycle and do you ride a bicycle? Okay, right. Yes, you ride a bicycle. So yes, because bicycles are small, smaller than any vehicle in the world. So let's give them importance. Let's give importance to them by building a cycle lanes. Yeah, and. Aside from that, it will help the environment to be better. Yeah, because we can lessen the pollution caused by all vehicles like cars, buses, motorbikes, yeah, trucks, all of them. It's better to cycle. And also, we can improve health problem with it. You will be... Um, you will be you it will make you fit away from diabetes away from heart diseases cardiac arrest high blood because it's also a form of exercise so now on how do you read this word look at my screen cycle okay that cycle what about this one decision you say decision decision how about this? Cyclist. Okay, very good. So now, let's proceed with this one. Thank you for your opinion. So I want you to read the task below. Then plan your essay by following the instruction. So your local council has decided to stop giving under 18s cheap travel on buses. So I want you to write a letter of complaint about this decision. Explain why it is bad for teenagers and for the environment. So first, you brainstorm ideas for the pros and cons. When you say pros and cons, that's the advantage and disadvantages of offering young people cheap travel on buses. Then you choose a main reason for complaining about the decision. Then choose one argument in favor of the council decision and say why you do not accept it. Then make a paragraph plan for your letter. You use your answer in task 3 below to help you. So here, explain the reason for writing. Give the main argument for your opinion and describe Describe personal experience and strongly restate your overall opinion. You can write your letter following your plan from task 7 here. You can use a phrase from task 5 to begin with a final paragraph. Here it is, Anne. Take your time.
Okay, so we have here, dear sir or madam, I am writing to describe my disappointment. Oh, at the local decision to stop giving under 18 ship travel on these buses. Firstly, the advantages of offering young people ship travel on buses is helping them discover places that they have never arrived before. Secondly, they will learn more about historical and geographic, uh, geographical of that places. What, there's still more? Oh, not yet finished. So you have two minutes left, Anne. Ah, okay. So just, re just read your answer. It's okay. For the continuation. Or if you can write it, then that could be good. Make it faster. 